welcome back to another episode of Fruit Till 5. I just had a couple of cycling tips. I made it 15 miles the other day. I actually cycled all day. I did not drive my car one time. Inspired by High Carb Hannah and the D-Men doing all their biking. So I had a couple mental notes. So this is going to be directed to Nicole. Dear Nicole, whenever you're going cycling, don't forget food. I took food yes with me yesterday, but probably not enough, and so I ended up eating out, which is a bummer. Definitely take more food. Next tip, don't give up. <laughs> as soon as I got on my bike, the tires were flat, but I walked the bike across the street to the gas station to refill the tires. The front tire was fine, and I got it full of air, and when I moved to the back tire, I couldn't get the little plug cover off at all. <laughs> I don't know, like maybe I'm just getting old. And so I asked some guy to take it off for me the old fashioned way. Excuse me, sir, can you help me? I can't get this off. Of and he did and I got the tires back online. You could basically use that anywhere. If you ever need help, a lot of people just here and there are willing to help you. And um, another thing is take tools. <laughs> I actually ended up having to buy this wrench, crescent wrench, and some uh, zip ties at an auto zone because my pedal fell off. It just fell off. I don't know. Maybe I'm too, I am started thinking I was too tubby for the bike. <laughs> like, maybe it's revolting against me because I am too tubby. I ended up repairing the bike with the help of AutoZone and some passerby. He had held the pedal perfectly flat and I wrenched it in and it was great. A couple different things about riding. You, Nicole, are a red light runner, sort of. I tend to take off when, when the last person is done and I know it's gonna be us next and the light hasn't turned green yet, but I've decided I'm gonna go. Hey, be careful when you do that, Nicole. It's kind of not a good idea, but it kind of is. Nothing bad has ever happened to me, but I take off early and I just get out of their way quicker, that's all you do. You definitely need like an iPad or, an, or not an iPad, this is a shuffle or something like that because you don't want to kill the battery on your phone. Um, I've done that before too. I just thought I would take a quick second here to uh, show you my bike. You've got basically a little piece of electricity here. Basically gives me a push and helps me out in the beginning. It helps me because I'm tubby and I don't want to ride the bike. I'm sorry. It gets me on this bike because there is a piece of electricity to help me out in those crazier times. Oh, my tip of all tips. This is my tip of all tips. You know those gay shorts that everybody wears? You have to have them. It turns out you cannot ride the bike for more than like 25 minutes unless you have this crazy, crazy pad on your butt. Actually, if you turn it inside out, this is the gel pad they got going on here. And it's this, it's the seat of, of a bike. And even the bike is padded too. Like there's a padding on there and there's a padding on here. And I was able to ride for hours yesterday. It was very cool. And I ended up buying some gloves too because right here on my hands, it's starting to get all crazy. I would also say make sure to have at least four lights <laughs> or five. I don't know. You need to have these. When I put this on the front, this helps. But when I put it on the back, like they'll have a red setting, a red flash. They're also on my helmet in the back. Lights are very important. Even when you don't think you're gonna ride into the night, they still help out in the daytime. Uh, one final tip is to smile. I smile all the time. Probably people think I'm hitting on them or something, but I'm not. I smile, I wave, I say hi, I ring my little bell. Yeah, I got a bell. <laughs> so just those few things. Um, to smile, have fun, listen to your music, take tools, don't give up, eat food, take food, pack food, and ask for help when needed. Anyways, get on your bike, do some walking, do some running, do some movement. <laughs> take care, peace.
Our lives already changed. No, I know. Their lives. Oh, their life? Yeah. They need to stop eating meat. 